spanning or spinning spreaders. Time waits for no squid. That sounds like a lot. But I love how there's two titles for it, or a title and a subtitle. Ooh. This is really creepy. Spreader, yikes! Oh shit, you're right. I, I almost didn't notice that. Just coming directly at me. Okay, this music's creeping me out. Hey! Whoa! Oh no! I got cocky. I figured I could take him on. I can handle it, don't worry. We'll reach the next checkpoint with no problems. Punk? Okay. So, I understand how I'm supposed to get there now. I'm supposed to ride the spreader all the way over there. But what if I, you know, just throw a bomb? Okay. Got my money. Is this like... An octopus themed f carnival area? But, like, made by the inklings that dedicated to the Octarians in a creepy way? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I still would like to eventually understand the whole scenario with the inklings and the Octarians. So obviously, the Octarians lost the war. And were either banished or hidden off, but they're still alive. So... Did they just hide off somewhere? God. I need all the scrolls and then a wiki. And I'll just, like, read it for an entire night. Hmm. Hmm. I would very much like to see what's on this platform over here. Because obviously I can reach it. Ah, it's a scroll! Well, that's easy, okay. Oh, that's terrifying. <laughs> I thought it was gonna just, like, take me directly to a platform. I mean, technically it did, but jeez. Okay. Well, we got the scroll pretty early on. I'm liking that. Oh, wait, no! There were power eggs on the platform. I didn't notice. Damn it. Well, if I throw a seeker this way, maybe I'll. Nope. Alright. It did not reach the platform at all. Ding boo! <laughs> Woo! I... That was risky. That was real risky. That could have gone so much worse. Squid jumps only from this point onwards. Oh, that could have gone bad as well. Jeez, okay. No jumps are safe unless you go to the very optimal edge piece of them all. Oh, boy. Wait for him to come towards me. And shoot them. How to do, neighbor? <laughs> oh, hey. There be the key, you bucko. Are you trying to imitate? Yep. Your Captain Cuttlefish impression needs work. I agree with Marie. It definitely does. Okay. I want the other balloon, I want it quickly. <laughs> I have very little patience for these things. Yeah, look at that. In the end, it all worked out. Is this a zapfish? No, nope. it's just a platform leaving the zapfish. Oh boy. Smells like octolings! Oh no, you're right. There's two of them right there. So you're telling me they're not gonna be fooled by my seekers? That's disappointing. <laughs> Too bad they'll die to them anyways! Woo! 
<laughs> wow, that actually sounded like the captain. What? Wait, what happened? Marie did a good impression of the captain. But I was too busy dealing with the Octoleague, so I missed it. Oh. Bomb rush ahoy! Ooh. Oh, that's funny! Oh my god! That would be absolutely hilarious to bomb spam seekers at people. I would love for that to be a multiplayer thing. But it's not, so that's just actually disappointing. Well, that is three zapfishes down. Three more to go. It's Black Friday every day at the Booyah Base Ultra Mega Hyper Sale. Every deal's a door buster. If you want to be the freshest squid in Inkopolis, you cannot miss this incredible shop opportunity. <laughs> okay. But you know what? I've already bought everything that I want to have in the shops. So, you know, uh, at this rate, you'll save the great zapfish in no time. Good. All right. Thank you for the encourage it. Encouragement. Encourage it. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to. 19, which is this way. <laughs> I like how that can go through the ground. Tumbling Splatforms. The Tentacles of Fate. Wow, this sounds like an incredibly dramatic level. The Tentacles of Fate. Ooh. Uh, this is kind of terrifying. <laughs> the great squidlings, the great tentacles, will rule over us all one day if we allow them to return. Look at that platform go! Oh yeah, I guess that's the gimmick of the level. These platforms are just gonna rotate. That's funny. Okay. I can handle myself around them though. Looking good, Agent Three. Damn straight. Uh, I left a couple of power eggs behind, so I'm gonna go ahead and head on over there. Because every little bit helps. And soon I'll be able to increase my splat rate. And this gun's going to be ridiculous. Although I'm terrified that there's going to be, like, a scroll past one of these platforms. Or underneath one. Because I have to ride the whole way down. But maybe not. Because you are still affected by gravity when you're in ink form, so I don't think an upside down platform would be a good idea. Oh, that's the wrong weapon. <laughs> All I want to do is throw a secret at the dude. I just let me take gander around the area. Anything missing on the sides? Uh, let us check. Nope, we're good. Okay. Now I'm gonna go kill the silly little doofus up there. Nothing bad's ever gonna happen in my life! Oh god! <laughs> Throw the bombs! They should have been pre inking the area. Obviously, ink is incredibly important for both sides of the war. So you'd figure they'd do that. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Uh, you're just making sure there's nothing around there. Let's get out. Oh no. Oh, I barely made it. <laughs> That's one. Don't lose your balance now. Oh, don't worry. I've dealt with tons of spinning platforms in the past. Even if I haven't played that many platformers. I understand the juice. Oh boy, I start sliding down. That was scary. <laughs> you know, I just thought of something worse. What if the scroll is not past or underneath a spinning platform, but within a spinning platform? Oh gosh. That'd be awful. If I was a level designer, I'd do it. 
you know? So you only see the entrance to the scroll, like, every time, like, once it spins around all the way. It'd be mean. I like how when I kill these things, <laughs> they explode into yellow ink. I think that just happens to everything, but it's just especially more amusing with bomb things. Hey look! The Zapfish! Now we can start worrying about where the hell the other things are. Oh boy. Did I miss anything back here? Mm -hmm. It doesn't incredibly look like it. Okay, then we're assuming that we have it. Oh boy, this is bad. Scary place. Oh! <laughs> Sometimes it can be real scary when you start sliding down a ramp. Howdy. Climb three of these and it's Zephish time! Ooh. What? Hello. That's not what I was expecting at all. <laughs> all I had to do was turn around for that one. I figured it'd be like a standard level design thing to like incorporate. Oh boy. Uh, to incorporate the scrolls in a way that made sense. With the theme of the level. Spinning platforms? Spinning scrolls! God damn it. I slid off. Oh. I gotta do it all over again. So sad. <laughs> Sometimes being in a rush isn't good for your health. That's the lesson we've learned. I don't mean I had to go back through and get the <laughs> the scroll again. It's just big punishment. Like, no, 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 you know where it was. Yeah, retrieve it. All right, this should work. Speed! No! Oh, 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 oh. Not speed. What did I just talk about, friends? <laughs> But I figured I could make it. Damn it, come on. Okay. <laughs> Phew! Didn't think you'd make it, to be honest. To be honest, I technically didn't the first time. Oh. Uh... <laughs> ah, you know what I've just finally got <laughs> after all of these levels? So, when I wear armor, or when I get armor in the levels, that's what that jacket thing is. It wasn't my jacket from beforehand showing through. It was what happened. Uh, is the big fluffy one providing shelter for the little fishy one? Or is the little fishy one manipulating the big fluffy one? We may never know. <laughs> sea and enemies and clown fishes. <laughs> well, we do have that one sea and enemy Shop seller who has a clownfish in her hair. Ooh. You know, speaking of which, there are so many, like, species of sentient humanoid things. You know, we have, like, a shrimp dude. We have jellyfish things. So, give me some. <laughs> there you go. Uh, but did they get mutated too? Or were they, you know, genetically modified by the Inklings? Oh. Alright, so this was 20 or 19. Wow, Graham said you were good, but I didn't expect this. Well, I, I guess I am I'm wearing your leftover gear. I figured they were dead when he said that. <laughs> he said He said that I was using their hand-me-downs, and I was like, oh, I, they died. That's bad. But not really. Oh gosh. Level 20. Octolings. Octoling Uprising. Battle at Battlefin Depot. Boy. 
The octolings with seaweed on their heads are super tough. Oh. Agent 3, try to take the high ground. All right, I'll just stay up here forever. Ha-ha! <laughs> Splat it up good and get going! That is exactly what I plan on doing, friend. Don't worry. But you're gonna have to give me some time because I don't exactly have the most upgraded weaponry. I blame you guys. You guys should have upgraded these things yourselves. Jeez. Oh boy. There are a lot of platforms I can go through. What does that say? Oh boy! Ah, oh, are you serious? Now I have to go fight that first one again. Seaweed warrior lady. Try and ambush me now, lady. Ooh. Got close, all right. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> they legitimately have little octo octopus swim forms. I can't believe they put in all the effort to have the octolings have very similar forms to the inklings. And even have like swimming forms and things like that. And then not include them in the multiplayer in any kind of way. I mean, maybe it'll happen eventually, but as of now, they're not there. <laughs> it, it, it just seems like it'd be a no-brainer for it to happen. Oh boy. I don't need this! Unless I get bum-rushed by a thousand of them. Damn it! Sometimes I hate railings. There we go. It's fine. I can see why the Actarians lost the last war. They're not incredibly resourceful. What is this? Make Octoling a playable character. <laughs> I like that. Ah, oh, wow. Uh, some me ver <laughs> some very convenient me verse graffiti here. Okay. Is there one down there? I don't know. Woo! They broke my armor. But I broke her life. <laughs> Is that the only way up? What's well, the only way up? That ramp? Possibly. Or do you mean- Oh, boy! Or do you mean... That right there? The little ink rails? I don't know. I want to see. I saw you, like, examine the area. <laughs> it doesn't even, like, put the other one on reserve. It just completely outright replaces it. Okay. Woo! That is incredibly mean. I'm not always a kid, but when I am, I'm a squid. <laughs> okay. Did I leave anything down here? I didn't really s ink up this place that much. Which makes me feel like something's here. Like, say, a box? Oh, I guess just an alternate way back upwards. That's odd. Maybe this is a multiplayer level. There are a lot of levels in the campaign that I'm noticing are things that are, like, going to be unlocked later on as multiplayer levels. So, I wouldn't doubt that. Just, like, alternate ways back and forth throughout the areas. Oh god, look at all that. <laughs> all the graffiti in just one wall. I can't read some of those. They're too far away. Oh boy. Oh! Yeah! What is up? 
How do you like my advanced ink rail usage, lady? <laughs> right, there's nothing down here. I'm just trying to examine the areas. I want the last scroll. So I guess I'm gonna have to look around the environment real quick. Oh, wait, no, there it is. Crafty. <laughs> Just at the very end of the level, <laughs> right underneath the Zapfish platform. Thank you, oh glorious Zapfish, and all my bonuses. Now I can afford my next gun upgrade. Squid Squad's new album, Fresh Kids, takes their trademark squid core squ uh, sound to a whole new level. Critics call it an oral buffet of squidiosyncratic <laughs> wow. psychedelicacy. The perfect theme for any turf war. On sale now. I guess the Turf War soundtracks have been pretty catchy. I'll give them that. But sometimes they can remain in your head forever. And they never go away. And at that time, it gets very questionable. Oh yeah, those Zapfish just keep rolling in. Is that it? No other input for Marie? That's alright, understandable. Let me upgrade my weapon. Boom. Hero shot level three. I could have upgraded my ink tank, but come on. Being able to shoot faster is a little more preferable. Means enemies will die faster. I spent a lot of time submerging and unsubmerging anyways. <laughs> <laughs> 